Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Kaylin and we are back with another video video video. This video is a little Sunday reset. I have some things to do. I need to get some homework done that's due tonight. We're going out for a little fall activity. We're doing a pumpkin patch today and then I want to be able to meal prep my meals for the week and then do my calendar for the week as far as what I need to do to get done for school, work, appointments, all that. So it's just gonna be a little reset. Uh, we cleaned a little bit earlier. We're just resetting and gonna start the week off with everything ready and yeah so let's just get into it i'm gonna head downstairs and start doing some homework i just put baby girl down for her nap she can't take her full nap so i put her down a little bit earlier because when i wake her up we gotta get going to head to the pumpkin patch so let's go <laughs> Okay, so you guys are going to see me looking very intense because I am reading comments from my professor based off of things I've already submitted that I have to include in this final paper and I just did not know what sis was talking about. So that explains my faces, but I'm trying to finish up this paper so that I can just be a free woman. So I finished my paper. I just need to reread it, which I'll do later, but we are getting ready to go out to the pumpkin patch. I am very upset with my hair. I ordered 18 inches and this is just not 18 inches. This is like 16, but we'll make it do. I might order another one, but I really don't need to spend any more money. But I put some lashes on, called it a day. We're all in our little matching outfits, which I'll show you when we get there because we are running late. So we're going to go right now, but I just wanted to tune back in and give you guys an update. So let's go. You guys, I underestimated how fun this activity was. If you have not done this yet this fall, go to a pumpkin patch. We had apple cider donuts, we had hot chocolate, got to see the animals. They had goats, baby cows, donkeys. We got to feed the goats. We got to go on a hayride. There was a little playground for the kids. And then at the end, we picked pumpkins and I picked up four, we got a little mini orange one, a yellow one, which I was surprised, a regular orange one, and then a white one. So we're gonna decorate the front of our house really nicely with those. But it was so nice seeing Cam enjoy herself at her first time. And I just highly recommend, 10 out of 10 for a fall activity.
all right y'all we are back home it was freezing outside freezing freezing so now we gotta warm up inside but i'm about to make baby girl some chicken nuggets i'll open up my jars that i got from amazon and then we'll meal prep together so I was inspired by TikTok to do this little salad meal prep. I'm gonna try it out for lunch, but I will link down the jars, the glass jars down below in my description box. I got them from Amazon. It's the exact ones I saw from TikTok. They seem pretty sturdy. We'll see how the salad holds up and if it's soggy or not. So I'll let you guys know later on. Anyway, in my salad, I put red onions, cucumbers, tomatoes, corn, black beans, chicken, and then a 50-50 spring green mix. So I used a dressing that I just picked up from BJ's, but you can use any dressing or you can make your own. Some people use like lemon juice and salt and pepper, but I wanted to use a real dressing. So what people have been doing is just taking the jar dumping it in their bowl when it's time to eat it stirring it up and then you have your meal so i was inspired we'll see how this week goes but i think they came out pretty great So I'm in my room. I am trying to get in the bed and go to sleep because I'm tired. It's 7 o'clock. We were out for pretty much most of the day. So now I'm just sitting down doing my planner for the week so that I can know what it is that I have to do. And then I'll just be submitting my assignment, my paper. <laughs> So like I mentioned, I'm just planning out what I have to do for the week. So it includes anything for school, any assignments that I have that I need to turn in, any housework or cleaning that I have to do this week, meal plans for my lunch. We already did the meal prep, so it'll just be what we're going to eat for dinner this week. Any YouTube stuff, any deadlines I need to do for either future videos or she persists with purpose stuff, any of that that I need to do, I have a section for. I also have a section for any appointments or events going on throughout this week, which I don't think I have any, but then I ended off with my exercise, which is when I'm going to go to Orange Theory for the week and when I'm going to do my home workouts. So that's pretty much all I need to do. I just put everything on my calendar. 
and I can do like the detailed ones like as each day goes but I just need to get a gist so then when I open up my calendar I at least know what I need to do I'm waiting for the pizza to get out of the oven for dinner um I'm gonna submit my paper I honestly like I just don't care anymore like I have the itis I just I have one more assignment to do which I'm gonna try to do tomorrow that's due next week and I'm just like I'm over it I just I'm extremely tired of doing like I'm I'm tired of doing homework it's like unfortunate but and like if she tells me to do any like revisions or anything I'm changing one thing and I'm submitting it again I I'm just like I'm over it I just want to be free I can't wait to not have to do homework like you guys have no idea well if you're in school you know but I'm like I'm over it all right so that's done so I need to take off these lashes take off my makeup and I'm just gonna end my night eating and then getting into my books I'm reading this book, which is really, really good. I kind of made a dent, not really. It's 620, 624 pages, and I'm on page 189. But then I started Happy Place by Emily um, Henry the other night, and I'm on page 33, I believe. And I'm reading this in a book club for my job. So I might just read this one because I was just trying to read something light that I don't really have to like use my brain too much. Like this one has a lot with like the places and the things that they're talking about, but I love this book. But I think I'm gonna read the Emily Henry one and just take it easy and call it a night. So thank you guys for hanging out with me this Sunday. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.